Uh, welcome back into the show. I'm Rob Finnerty with Alex Kramer. The 94th Annual Academy Awards happening last night. The story everyone is talking about is what you just saw. The slap heard around the world. Yeah, yes, everyone in the audience was shocked as Will Smith took to the stage and appeared, as you just saw, to smack comedian Chris Rock after he made a joke about his wife, Jada. And here with more is entertainment and media expert Jackie Jordan. Welcome to Wake Up America. Hi, good morning, Wake Up America. Hi, Rob. Hi, Alex. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm still recovering from seeing that. Yeah, I, I am too. I think it it was like really quite shocking, disturbing, and um, I had to like calibrate, like was that staged, real, or, um, and then obviously it appears to have been uh, real. And what's so interesting about it, there's, there's so many ironies here. First off, uh, the Academy Awards and the Oscars really needed a ratings boost, and I'm not saying that this was, uh, um, would change that for them. They had uh, Will Packer was a first time producer for the show. And, um, you know, but the irony around the slap specifically was that about five years ago, Jada Pinkett was very vocal about hashtag Oscar so white. And so the Academy of Motion Pictures, Arts and Science has really spent the last five years, especially under Don Hudson's rule, to make, to even things out. Uh, in the best way they could. And you could see from the red carpet yesterday and all of the appearances, you know, how diverse uh, the uh, Oscars were. And one of the things that Jada Pinkett had stood uh, up against was the fact that she had felt Will Smith had been overlooked. So last night is Will Smith's big shining moment. He looks and like he, he's going he to He ruined win. it, though. I think he, did, he ruined it. He won um, Best Actor uh, later <laughs> in the night, but then he, he had to use that time to apologize for smacking Chris Rock in the face. I mean, I don't think it was the moment that he's been building toward for 35 years. No, exactly, exactly. And in any other circumstance, where would you not see an arrest happen for something like that? Like right. that is, you know, that is, you know, as we 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 would expect. I mean, that's an assault. Right. What we witnessed was an assault. It was violence. And you know, the Academy Awards prides themselves on being the leader in in morale and diversity and inclusion. Uh, and and you know f f filmmaking and storytelling and so to see this was really really disturbing and it also really stole from all the other winners like I thought it was really impressive that Jane Campion won for best director uh, she was uh, last nominated for the time when she uh, w was nominated as director for the piano and, and she lost to Steven Spielberg who won for Schindler's List so it's been a long run for her and uh, one of my favorites who is completely overlooked is singer songwriter Diane Warren I think she has racked up more. Uh, Oscar nominations and Susie, Susan Lucci did for Emmy nominations and still has not yet to, uh, taken home that trophy. But I think we're all going to be really recovering from uh, the slap that was was heard around the world. Yeah, and who's going to get the first interview with Chris Rock? I mean, I just, I think this is the biggest story from the Oscars, Alex. Sorry, go ahead. Yeah, no, I was just going to say that um, according to the LAPD, Chris Rock, he said he's not going to file any report or anything on well, Smith, do you think that that's the right move, or do you think he should file a report? Well, you know, it's very interesting. I think that, you know, the LAPD sometimes uh, operates from their own set of rules, and sometimes the Hollywood has their own set of rules for uh, the way things go. We, we get to see them as their own little microcosm. I, I think that, I think Chris Rock was gracious. I mean, it was, an alter, it was not an altercation between Chris Rock and Will Smith. Right. Will Smith assaulted right. Chris Rock. Yeah. For making a joke when you're a public figure, uh, as uh, Will Smith and Jada Pinkett uh, Smith are, you 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 do become part and, of. And Jackie, cult let's 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 jokes. be honest. We're I don't mean to interrupt you, but we're so we're tight on time. But this was I mean, go back throughout Oscars history, and we've seen a lot worse when it comes mm -hmm. to hosts or presenters making jokes. Oh, I mean, sure. a lot worse. This was a joke for about sure. about GI Jane, and mm -hmm. and that's what Chris Rock said. I, I think Chris Rock composed himself and handled this. Amazingly, so well. after Absolutely getting well. hit in the face in front of the world. I mean, not a lot of the world was watching, but they are now. Ritual. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Very much. It was. I think it was very humiliating. Um, I think he was really composed. I think he brought the show right back on track. I think everybody was stunned. I think everybody had the same reaction. The people that were there, was the viewers at home, where we like, was that staged? Yeah. Is that part yeah. of the comedy? I'm just yeah. glad he comedy? wasn't presenting the award for, for best actor, um, <laughs> yes, because that would have been really yeah. awkward. That didn't happen. Yeah. Um, Jackie Jordan, come back and see us. Thanks so much for the information. We appreciate it.